Howdy there, folks. How are y'all doing? My name is Reese, and welcome back to our Assassin's Creed Odyssey Let's Play Adventure. It's been a little while since I recorded last time. So long, in fact, I'm now at level 46. Now, before you ask, I knew we needed to be level, what was it, 42 to do the upcoming quests. And, of course, now that I have leveled up quite a bit, the quest requirements... I've also leveled up with me. I don't know why this is a thing that they do. I liked it better when you could level up and be super overpowered. But whatever the case, we're still a couple levels ahead of them, I suppose. But uh, we're ready to get back on it. We're ready to keep playing. I had originally planned on leveling all the way up to 50 and hitting max level. But my gosh, it takes so long to level up later game because I guess XP requirements go through the roof. There's been a bit of an upgrade to the game since uh, the last time I recorded. They've, they've changed a few things here and there. For instance, it now shows you whether or not the tier you're in is locked. I thought that tier 4 was unlocked when I got into it and that we were going to get 50% off ship upgrades. But no, we have to complete this tier. I need to go find these two, possibly also this guy here, and, and get my way into the next tier before uh, before tier tier 4 abilities will be ours. And it's, it's a whole situation. I did find some more of these ancient tablets so we could upgrade the ship, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until, you know, we can get our uh, half price upgrades. Looking forward to that. Abilities. My goodness, we have 12 ability points to assign before we continue. This this is madness. Well, immediately, Ghost Arrows of Artemis is one of the greatest things you can get in this game. This will upgrade it to deal 340% hunter damage, which is fantastic. We're obviously going to do that one. Uh, the Zoom Arrow, 550% hunter damage, travels 150% further. It's an obvious one. This one I haven't upgraded, but it is useful. This will slow the time down a little bit more, and this will hold the uh, slow the time down even a little bit more. I don't use multi shots. Should have probably never gotten it. It sounded cool at the time. Something I haven't done is upgraded the uh, keep your weapons clean and sharp, increase warrior damage by 20%. The reason I haven't done this is because I was under the assumption, and maybe I still don't quite understand how the game works, but I thought that because we were doing a hunter spec skill, the warrior tech stuff wouldn't really matter. However, even a weapon, any sword-based weapon, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think any sword-based weapon, even one that adds a certain amount of percentages to hunter damage, is still technically a, uh, a warrior weapon. So this should increase our sword damage. We probably should have gotten this a long time ago. It might be the reason why fighting with swords is slow, so slow and miserable, and it is very slow and miserable right now. If we hop back over to inventory, this is our damage right now. 873, 3036. Let's upgrade this one again and see if that changes. So this will give us a 30% increase into crit. I've already forgotten what this other screen said. 940, that is an improvement. That's good. Should we max it out? 40%, increases crit 10%. Combo finishers deal more damage when the combos contain both light and heavy attacks. Why not? We'll max that one out. I gotta, I gotta max this one out. The kick is so powerful that multiple targets can be hit by the shockwave. A yes, please. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Yes, yes, please. As for the next four, I don't know where to put them, and I'm not going to put them anywhere for now because I don't really know what would be the best thing. Break a small shield and deal 150%. So yeah, I'm not sure which one of these I would want to go for, so I'm going to hold on to the four of these. This one could be useful. Um, we can be invisible while moving. That Maybe we should just go ahead and get that one. And then we can be invisible while aiming a bow. Adrenaline slowly consumes slowly over time. Yeah, let's max that one out. We might end up using it. I don't think we have it assigned. Yeah, we do. Okay, then. Well, we'll see how far that gets. We'll see if that's useful at all. I'll hold on to the other two ability points in case we decide to shake things up a bit. I think I've got the best uh, weapons equipped that I can get, the best armor. And I think we're going to go ahead and do Unearthing the Truth. Socrates asked Cassandra to help. Oh man, this seems like ages ago. I've been doing so much playtime since. Side quests mostly, hunting down cultists, things of that nature, just to level up. Uh, help find information at the Acropolis that could turn the people against Cleon. Socrates asked her to meet at the Pinic Pinix once she found evidence of his madness. Well, that sounds like a fun time. Sounds like a great time indeed. I think I'm standing right on top of the guy because this just happened to be where the game dropped me off and I fast traveled here. Like that does look like someone uh, where Cleon would come. Should we try to be invisible for a little while? Oh, gosh. Oh, right. Uh, I'm wanted. I forgot about that. Can I turn invisible right now? I can't turn invisible right now. That's not an option. What do you think the odds are we could just run into this building and... Tr no, we need to be anonymous. Oh, fam. 
Oh, well, I mean, if they're hunting us, we might as well go ahead and steal some money, am I right? Oh, look at this little troop we've got! Okay, no, no, this is how we die. This is not going to end well for us. Even this random citizen is after me. They must have seen me stealing. Well, what am I supposed to do in a situation like this? Steal some more, I guess. I mean, what are they gonna do? Oh, it's a locked chest. Of, of course. I'm only a mercenary. I'm sure I've never picked a lock in my time. Why can't I climb this thing? Cassandra, what do you- what do you- what was that? All right, new plan. We know where we need to go, which is like right there. So what if we jump into the hay here? And then, while we're hidden and no one can- No, how did you guys already find me? How does that happen? How? I jumped into the hay! You couldn't see me! Don't lie! None of- No! Stop! I just- You know what? Let's just get away from him. Let's just run away. Okay, so I've run around to the other side of the wall. And I'm kind of going to try to sneak in from over here. And now we're going to... Well, I was going to say let's activate that ability that makes us invisible, but... I think we've done it. It says we need to be anonymous, but... No one's going to find me in here, and while I'm here, I'll just go ahead and steal all this stuff, because... They, they can't they, they can't stop me. There's no way they can stop me. I'm completely hidden. Look at all this cool stuff that I'm getting. Okay, any minute now they'll give up looking for me. And we'll be good to go, right? I'm just looking at that bar at the bottom of the screen. I'm ready for it to go away. They're looking over there at the staircase. Look, we can keep an eye on them. Uh, this is a uh, bird overhead. I repeat, this is a bird overhead. We are, uh, this is the Icarus cam. I repeat, Icarus cam. Oh, no, they're coming to the window. They're not going to look in here and see me, though. No way. You guys need to go, man. I am still anonymous, game. Stop telling me that. I am as anonymous. Oh, no. That was that sound effect. I said sound effect again. Do I need to kill this guy? What I'm asking is, do I need to shoot this guy through the wall, or will that rouse suspicion? Let's be patient. If he comes in here, then we'll deal with him. Not until. Not until. Not until. Not. Okay. We're good. What do I need to do? It says it's an investigation area. What am I investigating? What if someone wanders in front of the door? Oh no. Oh no. Oh! Oh no! No, 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 no! No, no, no! Not gonna have it today! Not gonna have it today! Oh! Okay. Nobody panic. It's all good here. It's all good here. Yeah, muddy tracks. You would think so, wouldn't you? If I mean, if there's a recently used shovel and some muddy tracks, there's a dog coming. There is the dog a threat? Do we need to worry about the dog? Is the dog on the soldier's side? I can't risk it. What if the dog is on the side of the soldiers? Would, would do we kill the dog? And if we kill the dog, do we eat the dog? Dog, please just go away, dog. I need to check. Mm. Ah! Ah! Let's just low, low key, low key. Letter to Cleon. Phylos. Okay, we'll go find Phylos. We'll get ourselves a key. Everybody just remain calm. Oh. Yeah, you're probably right about that. This is... We probably need... Oh, okay. The, is that the Commander Phylos? It's locked. That's probably him right there. Great. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. We'll just sneak over there and we'll kill the Commander. And What's the worst that could happen? I mean, if we get spotted here, it could be all over with, but that's a massive if, you know what I mean? And there's so many ifs in the world, we're not even going to worry about this one. I mean, if everyone worried about every if, can you just, the world would just be in a state of chaos. Can I do a save here? <gasps> oh, thank goodness. Well, that's a small progression then. Also, <laughs> I've been playing the game for almost 60 hours. Madness, I tell you. Ah! 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 Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. No, we're good. We got away with that. We got away with that. We should have scouted the area first. We should have had... Should have had... Uh, where is Icarus Cam? Icarus Cam is on Overwatch. Target has been located. Is the target surrounded by other enemies? Can confirm the presence of other enemies inside of the building. Do they have eye contact? I do not believe so. Back to you on the ground, Cassandra. Thank you, Icarus Cam. Thank you very much. Can we take this guy out in one shot? No, we cannot, but we'll risk it. We'll risk it. One shot. Can we get him in the second shot? If he'll hold still, I can get him in the... What is he doing right now? One shot, two shot. Red shot, blue shot. Ugh, hop on pop. Whew. If only we'd landed a head shot on that second round, we wouldn't have wasted that extra bar of stamina. But it will regen over time. So it's not that big an issue. We've got the key. We can get back over to the chest. We should probably do a save, though. <laughs> but 
<laughs> we'll save again. And then that way, if anything goes wrong, we won't have to do this bit again. Where was that save? Was it up here on that ledge? You got to get into a yellow area up there at the top of the screen before the game will let you do a save. If you're in a red area, it's just a no-go. It's just not going to happen. The game is just not going to allow that. And you know what? To a degree, I understand. I understand how the game feels about that. And we made it back. I should have I should have gotten Icarus Cam on the job. Should have been surveying the area before we flew in. What have I got here though? Oh, hold on, hold it down. And what have we got here? This is exactly what we needed. Is it a snake staff? What are we going to do with that though? Doesn't matter. I'm sure Socrates is going to Oh, Cle Cleon's papyrus. That's probably more so what we need. That's probably more important than a, a snake staff. Unless the snake staff is a symbol of the cult. In which case, I mean, most people don't like cults. Unless you're in one. But usually when you're in a cult, you don't realize you're in a cult. And therefore, you still dislike cults. But then all everyone around you is like, it doesn't make any sense, though. Why would you have liver failure for not paying $3 million to, to go through stage one? I don't understand why. I could read that book. I wouldn't get liver cancer. Didn't the person who started all this die? Why couldn't he use his superpowers to stay alive? And then they're just like, No, it's not a cult, though! You don't understand! I'm Tom Cruise! Good, you're here. The people are waiting for me to speak. You should be able to use this to your advantage. It's what I could find about Cleon. Mytilene is just the first of many places that he wants to wipe out. With the sway he has over the police, He'd get the votes for death every time. Then it's up to us, right now, to change their minds. So, you'll join me? Yeah. Yeah, I'll join Talking you. Talking to the people may not be enough. We need to show them why following Cleon is wrong. I'm surprised to hear you suggest such an idea. Desperate times. Isn't that what you said? So I did. Follow my lead and respond as if you're one of Cleon's supporters, not mine. Sure thing, fam. Sure thing. But Socrates, Cleon is a man of the people. Tell me, if you harm someone with a sword, are you not responsible? I am. What if you hired someone else to harm another? Are you still responsible for that harm? Oh. Uh... I am. Yes, I'd still be responsible. You are almost too insightful, and you're completely right. If someone should be hurt by any means, and we play any role in that hurt, we are still responsible. We have agreed that we may harm another, even if not by our own hands. That's right. So, let me ask you another question. Who should you trust, the many, or the one who has more expertise? Well, that is a very good question there, Socrates. I decide with the crowd. The majority is always right. That's not true. And who is informing the majority? That's, that's just not I true at all. we're following the one at the top. And if you found out the person at the top had lied to the people you follow... I'm just trying to go well along with what I think is going to do best for the story moving forward, you know what I mean? Um, I'd find people someone new. Nor should they. After all, if someone lies to you a single time, what's to say they would not do so again? You make yes. an excellent point You're there, right. sir. So you agree that someone who lies to you is not worthy of leading? Of course. Oh, Athenians. <laughs> would you not also agree that you can have responsibility for harming another even through someone else? I would. And would you follow someone you found out had lied to you for their own gain? Of course not. Above all things, therefore, I beg and implore you, hear these words. The one you currently follow is lying for his own gain. Cleon has lied to you in order to get the votes needed to attack Mytilene. And we have the proof that he'll do it again. Should the ship arrive in Mytilene, the people stand no chance of surviving. Now that you know the truth, you can take back your decision. Another vote must be called. The lives of those people are in your hands too. The ship must be stopped. <laughs> what was that? What is he doing? He's just, he's just gesticulating wildly. Uh, 
that probably could have gone better, but even so, I believe the people are unable to deny the proof we presented. Yeah, uh, yeah, I hope so. All we did was talk. What we did was far more. We used proof and clear argument to bring forth an outcome that will not just hurt Cleon, but hopefully save countless lives. But was it enough? I believe word of Cleon's misdeeds will be shared throughout Athens. Its citizens love the city and what it stands for. Nobody wishes for it to fall. Hmm. Hmm. Cool. Well, that was pretty straightforward. I I understand now why it wanted us to be such a high level to do it. Although we didn't really fight anything the second time around, we just did a lot of sneaking. Next quest up on the docket is an actor's life for me, Athens' finest actor, Thespis. I probably said that wrong. Was nowhere to be found. If Aristophanes wanted his next play to succeed. In its critique of Cleon, he needed the talent of this man. Cassandra swore to find him. Ooh. You don't look like an actor, unless you're playing an Athenian guard. I. In which I, case, he's a very good actor. Hush, he looks just like an Athenian guard. Mutters like one as answer. well. But Commander Rexenor. What's your name? Bullis. Well, Bullis, it's your choice whether you walk out of here. Do you understand? Yes. Ah, uh, you must know You'd better more. better be telling me everything. All I know is they wanted to keep this actor busy. See for yourself, he's at the tavern. You sure, that's all? I just follow the commander's orders. I don't ask questions. Hmm. Mm, you should, uh... Don't Get let me see you again. And count yourself lucky. I know that usually we're pretty Thank savage. You. Thank you. But today, we're gonna show a little bit of mercy, because we've been through a lot, us, Cassandra. We've had some hard times. We fought our brother in a burning forest. It wasn't an easy time for us. It, things have been a little bit rough lately, you know? We had to accuse the Spartan king of of being a cult member. And then we were right. He was a cult member. It, it, things have been a little rough, you know what I mean? Things, we're going to show a little bit of mercy. You know, the, the way we would like to have mercy shown to us, we will show a little mercy. What am I supposed to do in this situation? Talk to the thespian? He's surrounded by guards. I don't think I can just hop down there and have a chat with them. Maybe I'm wrong on that, though. It won't let me attack them. All right, maybe it's one of those situations where they're kind of incognito. Should we sneak up there? Should we use our invisibility powers? Talk. Ah, I thought we would be invisible during the cutscene. How good would that have been? Yeah, what's business? Oh, look at you. Well, hello there, stranger. Rude. Not without Thespis. I'm here for his employer, Aristophanes. So, he's not working now? Yes, he's not working. I, I like him though, Aristophanes, funny man. But the opinions told him it's dangerous. That it is. I need him sober and rested. I don't think you understand the situation. Commander Raxenor's orders are he's not to leave. I said I'd stay. Don't want trouble. Uh, let's make a deal. Go back to your. your <laughs> Never mind. We're gonna be else. savage. Oh, jeez. You will regret that. Uh, do I have to fight him now? From your smell, you already know where the goat pens are. Oh. I'm sure they miss you. Please, he's walking away. No, why? Why must you antagonize them? Cassandra, why? Why, 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 why have you done this? Why have you done this? Oh, this is my fault, honestly. I <laughs> I was the one who chose these dialogue options. I didn't realize she was going to antagonize him as he walked away. Why must you escalate the situation? Dadgummit. I don't want to hurt a bunch of civilians and make things worse for myself here in town, as we already have, like, a bunch of bounty hunters after us, but why not? We're already invested. Let's just blow up everyone. No, except for this guy. Oh, wait. Oh, oh no. This guy is actually a bounty hunter. They're so hard to deal with. I don't want to fight a mercenary. It's a real big hassle. Is this even one of the ones that we need to kill to level up? I, I don't know. Civilians are attacking me now, too, I might add. It's a hassle and a half. I'm going to have to deal with it, though. I need to heal. Let's heal. We'll heal. I was going to do a superpower, but we'll heal. Maybe we can get some mad... Oh, we're on fire. Oh! Dad, gummit. He just showed up out of nowhere. I'm going to have to kill the civilians. I've got no choice. They're too much of a hassle. Wh who are you? Where did you even come from? Where are all these guards coming from now? Ooh. Yeah, look out for the fire there, dude. 
Oh, gosh, I needed that so badly. You have no idea how badly. Well, I guess you could see my health gauge at the bottom, so you know exactly how badly I needed to heal. Can we just, like, hide here? Do you reckon? Do you think that's possible? They might not even realize I'm here right now. What do I need to do? Kill that last guard over there? What if he also wanders off, though? Do you think I could... What are the odds that I could? I mean, if I could do this. I don't even technically see him, though. Where is he? Okay, bounty hunters are walking away. We need that. Is that guy... In oh, he's down there in the valley. I was going to say, is he invisible? If we can one-shot him, and we can end this... We can't even shoot through this stuff to hit him, though. Dad gummit, that was a mistake. I didn't mean to press that button just then. Ah! Oh, he's gotta die. He's gotta die, but we gotta kill him without drawing any attention. Ready? One shot. Oh, you need to come back out of there. Is that him right there? Is that his legs? Oh, dad gummit! Got him! Okay. Okay, and now we carry this guy, and then we just get out of here without being spotted. They do, do they see me? Oh, they're headed over here. They are headed over here like they know I'm here. Where am I supposed to take him? We're going in literally the wrong direction. We're being chased, so what am I supposed to do? I can't fight two bounty hunters at once with a guy on my back. They definitely seem to be acting like they know where I'm going, or where I am. Or maybe they do also know where I'm going, like I've just wandered into a... Can I turn invisible? <laughs> That's not what I meant to do! That's not what I wanted to do! Oh, Dad, come it! Oh, he's throwing fire bombs! Get out of my way, son! Okay, nobody panic. I think we've almost made it. Oh my gosh, get on the ground. What an intense experience that was. For I know true love. I just need you ready to perform tomorrow. Of course, and I just need my muse. My love, I can't. I won't perform without her. Uh, pull yourself together, son. You need to sober up. This play is important. So say Caterini. I need my muse. Please. She's just west of here at the house of Aphrodite. If it means you'll do the play, I'll find your muse. What is your muse? I said it. It's at the... Oh, gosh. They're still out there. They're still after me. They still know. They know what's up. We got to go find a muse, though. Like, I guess the band? I just realized that the name of this quest is uh, Musing, and we're looking for a muse, and I am not amused. Uh, not even slightly. Maybe it's because I looked up at the about 10 minutes into this recording and realized the audio was not working correctly, and I'm just trying to figure out what I'm going to have to do to fix it. At the need if I start editing and it just it seems like a big nightmare I'm gonna have to deal with. It's a lot of hoops I have to jump through. And I just uh, I, 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 uh said I'd find you here. Ah my darling Thespis, an artist in so many ways. But let's talk about us. Let's not talk about us. Thespis sent me. Don't understand. I need your help. So many do. These hands have helped more people than Hippocrates. Mm, no, I don't like the implications. Thespis told me to find you. Well, I'm not giving discounts to his friends if that's what you're thinking. I see what's no. going on here. Thespis wants you to go to him. He needs you to help him perform tomorrow. Thespis does love to perform, but he'll be doing it without me this time. Sure. You're his muse? Command Direction or has made it clear it would cost me my life if I were to associate with Thespis right now. Right, I can see how that's problematic, but the commander Don't won't worry. be a problem. I'll deal with Commander Exenor. You it's the one small favor the quest again. He is. One thing leads to, thing leads to another thing leads to another thing. What do you mean? Secret meetings, strange visitors. He gives me the creeps. You'll have to kill him. There's no other option. If I do this, will you go to Thespis? It'd be my pleasure. I'm sure it would be. Uh, the, the commander's a dead Don't man. Don't worry. I'll take care of him. Bring me back his little sword as proof. <sighs> I'll be back soon. Uh, is, there, is that like Let a... No man is that, oh, I remember. Okay. Yeah, I'd love to kill this guy. I'd love to kill... It's always fun to kill these guys. Is this... Was that a double entendre, though, was the question I was going to ask. It certainly seemed like it might have been. Okay, this seems like it's going to be extremely easy. He's got very minimal guards, like 
20 or 30 or so. Not a big deal. Uh, none of them are around him at the moment, except for that one right there. Now that we've gotten the lay of the land, though, check what we can do. <laughs> well, not that. We could just shoot him through this wall here. Not with that ability, though. With this one. Ah, uh, but do we want to? We could kill that guy. See, the thing is, we've only got enough... Ah, uh, Shrek. And we're gonna... Uh, try oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, we're inside now. We're just inside now. It's gonna have to be like this. We don't have to be secret about this. Let's just... Dad gummit, this has to happen. This has to happen. Let's just attack him as quick as we can, kill him as fast as we can, and then get out of here. Which oh, I, I cannot do a sustained long-term fight with all of these people. So let's just kill this one guy with as fast as as fast as we can, and uh, we'll confirm his kill. Oh goodness gracious! I wasn't sure if that was really gonna land. Confirm the kill. I say I say confirm the kill. Confirm the kill. Okay, and now we'll just. We just run away. We've done it. We've essentially we came here. We did everything we came to do. Those two guys, they know that we're here. They might follow us outside, but they're not going to follow us across the street at all. Uh, they're going to pretty much lose track of us as soon as we run inside of here and do this old double fake out. Look at that. They think I'm still inside of that room. They have no idea I'm on the roof. Completely safe. We've made our escape. Now we can end the quest. Maybe. Yeah. Easy. Not even a sweat. I mean, I don't think that's what she had in mind. Not quite the sword I meant. Yeah, I knew it. But as long as he's dead. Okay. Uh, da, da, um. My part is done. Go make sure Thespis is at the theater in time for his performance. You are too tense. Come here and lie a while. We've time to have a little fun. Or is it always business with you? Mm, I mean, we could probably stay a while, Isn't right? So blood does pulse in those veins. It roars. But what of Thespis? Thespis is an actor. Half the girls here have been his muse at one time or another. And then we awkwardly pan away. Hmm. I wonder what happened after it faded to dark. Now, we need to worry about Thespis and Aristophanes' play. This play is important to you. With it, we hope to make change for the better. I can see there is more in your eyes, but we are all entitled to our secrets. It's enough for you to know that I plan to stop men like Commander Rexenor and Cleon. Please tell me you have news of Thespis. He's fine, and he'll be fit to perform your play tomorrow. Oh, thank the gods. I know what actors can be like. Compared to what I'm used to, it was a breath of fresh air. That is so good to hear. Here, for your troubles. The people may be the heart of Athens, but my play will be his voice. Yeah, this guy's kind of confident, isn't he? <laughs> what was that? What? Fade to black. No, we're not done. No, yeah, we're done. Fade to black. Yeah, we got you. We got you. You got to admit, you were tricked. You were fooled. You thought the scene was over. You didn't realize we had another 30 frames for you. Cleon <laughs> should you also know what a pig's education he has had. Ah, it's funny because they said pig. And to think I was going to propose a statue to be erected in the city to each of you for your bravery. I don't, I think he's, he's a bit of, I think he's hurt, guys. I think you're hurting his feelings with this. I think this is a bit rude. He doesn't look so angry. He looks sad. I think he's going to start crying. I feel bad for him. I mean, he's a cultist and a bad guy, but I, I mean, I feel bad for him. Uh, okay, you know, now that I look at his face, he looks a bit like Joffrey here, so... Maybe I don't feel so bad for him. Also, he can't take a joke. He's, he's, he's going to go off and cry now. Well, I kind of feel bad for him. My gosh. I hope the play was amusing. <laughs> uh, hmm. 
Well, we should probably wrap up these quests here, but I actually need to wrap up this recording and check the audio because we had some sort of weird bug. And uh, for some reason, I'm in the recording profile right now on OBS, but the the capture card was using the audio settings for the streaming. So it was doing all kind of weird audio ducking stuff, and I got to figure out why that happened. Uh, it probably has to do with some, some recent changes we've been making to the setup and everything. I don't, I'll look into it. Until next time, thank you folks for watching. God bless you, and I'll see you later. Bye!